Alright, what's going on guys? Drex here with another video for today, and today I decided to actually bring you guys a setup video. I haven't done this in a very long time. Uh, this is a, like, you know, just a quick view of my setup right here. Um, I'm just gonna be going through all of, like, the peripherals I have and everything, like, all my devices that I have, and then I can give you guys more information on, like, how I like it, and, you know, maybe if you want it. So, let's start. Sorry about my hair, by the way. It's, uh, kind of, I, I don't even know what's wrong with it today, sorry. First up is my Razer keyboard, and I have actually had my Razer keyboard for a long time. Um, I got this for about 130 I believe. It was a lot of money, but you know what? It's doing me good. It's still working after three years. Functions very well, and the response time is very quick, so I am very pleased with this keyboard so far. It's treated me very well. This is actually a really popular keyboard. I, I'm sorry, I forgot the actual name. It's like the Chroma, like, Death Adder. I don't even know why I forgot the name, but this is a very highly requested keyboard, and most people use it, so uh, yeah, there you go. Next up is actually my mouse, and this is a Razer product as well, and uh, I've had this this for about uh, actually, about the same amount of time I've had my keyboard, so about three years. This is the Razer Death Adder Chroma. This changes color. It has different, you know, buttons on the side that you can use for, like, gaming and everything, like CSGO. I definitely like it. The scroll is really nice. It's a smooth feeling, and overall, it's a great mouse. You can adjust the sensitivity and everything. Highly request that you guys get that. Next up are my two monitors, and I've actually had these monitors. They are the same. They're uh, very nice Asus monitors, 21.5-inch flat screen HDMI cable everything it's got all the stuff that you need pretty much and it's really nice um, I believe it's a one a something millisecond response time it's like the best response time that you can get very slick and it's a slim design it looks really cool black overall and it's got all the uh, buttons on the side you can turn up the volume from the uh, side of the TV of the TV the monitor I'm sorry once again I highly recommend that you guys get this monitor it is very nice it's slim design like I said looks clean and it does the job and next is actually my Mac my Monitor. This is the uh, actual computer I have myself, but I guess you can say it's a monitor. Yes, it, it because it is slim design as always. Mac and you know Apple does a great job with their products. Um, I really like the overall look of it. It's really you know I like the the white on the bottom and like the black on top. Like you know that design that just, you guys just saw. That computer has a one terabyte fusion drive. That's the best that you can get. Unfortunately, I only have eight gigabytes on it because that's like you know that's the amount you can actually get it when you're ordering it. You can't go any higher than that. All right, now next up after the monitors is my blue snowball, and this is actually this this microphone is actually broken. So before you say anything about it in the comment section, this yes this is broken. Uh, it, has fallen but you know what it's still doing great like this is the microphone I use for all my videos as you guys know the grill of the microphone where it usually says blue it actually broke and it snapped but still it is still working I don't understand how I'm actually like working with this thing but you know what's doing the job it has three modes on the back of the microphone you guys are probably gonna see in a second or if not I already have um those modes actually allow you to switch the uh, mode or gear of the blue snowball to like being able to hear the background noise not not being able to hear the noise at all and hearing the like you know your voice directly like whatever like whatever is in front of it next up after the blue snowball is my scissor stand and that is what holds my mic and I have a lot to say about this okay so my scissor stand was actually $20 off Amazon I found it and honestly I was expecting it to be a lot bigger in person I thought I got the really big one but apparently I didn't I got like the I don't even know how big it is honestly at first when I got it it was doing really good I was just a little bit disappointed with the, with the size like I said and honestly it's just the design it's not the best and just it's not meant for the blue snowball I think it's meant for other mics well that's technically my fault on my hand it works well it's doing very well right now it's just like not my favorite it's a pain to handle but when I can handle it it just it does fine so I guess it's okay and lastly for the setup I have my mix amp and sadly I don't have the headphones because the headphones are broken I'm not sure what happened to them it shows really clean design overall and you know what it's got all the ports that you need to plug in your headphones and you, that's the best thing about this thing is that you don't have to worry about like your actual headphones like breaking and if they do you can just plug it into the mix amp and then you're fine you don't really need another mic you just use your earbuds it's got a knob so you can scroll up and down for the volume we're not the scroll just like move it back and forth like for the volume and everything and then it's got a power button and then you can use it for a game volume adjusting with your mic to make sure that the levels are equal very nice device I like it it's a great investment if you ever want it so hopefully you guys will 
will, you know, look at that and maybe enjoy it. <laughs> I don't know. But that's going to wrap it up for today's video, guys. So I'm sorry this video is a little bit shorter, but I, you know what? I just wanted to try something else instead of, like, you know, me picking up the camera being like, oh, guys, I got this stuff and everything. No, I wanted to make it look professional. I wanted to do it differently so you guys wouldn't be bored. You know what? It worked out, hopefully, anyway. I haven't really gotten into editing yet. Please leave a like if you guys did enjoy. I spent a lot of time putting this together, believe it or not, because shots are really hard to get. Hit that little red button at the bottom of your screen or like the bottom of, of this the video if you're not subscribed yeah there's like a little red subscribe button subscribe i'll see you guys in my next video have a great day night whenever you're watching this i don't know peace out